Hey guys, it's Mia here and welcome to my channel. I know you've seen this look on another video today, but I'm trying to record these two videos and get them out the way, edit, edit them today, and upload them today as well. So, as you can tell by the title of this video, this is a haul from over the weekend and I hope and pray everyone had a very blessed, safe, and great Valentine's Day. I know me and my husband did. We went actually to Riceville Beach, North Carolina, which they had a marriage, a Christian marriage seminar there for two days. Um, they had a seminar at 7 o'clock on Friday and then two seminars sun that Saturday morning. One was at 9, the other one was at 10.30. And we went to all three and it was wonderful. I may do a vlog on that um, or a video uploading talking about that. But if you do want to do that, thumbs up this video, let me know, or comment below as well. Okay, so let me get right into this haul because I don't want these, I don't like my videos being too, too long. Um, each store, I only went to four different stores, and um, each store I got like maybe in between one to four products. That's it. I'm not trying to keep it really super long for you guys. Um, so let me start with Walmart, which is the smallest one. I only got one thing from Walmart which was the Maybelline New York um, Volume Express Pumped Up Mascara in the color Classic Black. Y'all, I needed a mascara so bad. Like, I was running out of my other one. And I've seen people, um, not really reviews on this, but when they do, they, uh, do their um, makeup tutorials or whatnot, I've seen a lot of people use this one, and this is another one. Um, that's similar to this brand. I think it's in a, um, a green packaging or something. I'm not sure, but, so I got that. That's what I got from Walmart. Alright, the next one I'm going to do is from Ross. And I picked up, I went in there to try to find a Valentine's Day dress or outfit, uh, for the hubby and I. We went out that night and I ran across this shirt and I thought, this wasn't what I wore that night, but I thought this shirt was super cute. And it's nothing major. It's just a plain. And I've already wore it, you guys. I wore it Sunday on our way coming back home. And it's kind of like scrunched on the side, as you can see. And it's, it has black. Um, it's not even white. It's like cream or off color. Um, black and ivory stripes with the red. A hint of red. And I thought it was super cute. And I paid... $6.99 plus I'm sorry you guys $6.99 plus tax for this shirt okay and this is the dress that I ended up going with that I got from Ross I wore this for Valentine's night it's a really cute dress let me see if I can back it up a little bit it's almost it's a bodycon dress And I thought the necklace on it was super cute, super adorable. And the back is just like the front, it's just plain like that. But it's very shaped for me. And my husband was like, he really liked it on me. It complimented my body shape very well on my figure, I should say. He was like, your butt looks big in that dress. I'm like, okay. He said it three times, y'all. <laughs> he was like, your butt looks really big in that dress. I was like, okay, is that a bad thing? Do you want me to, do you want me to change or whatnot? He was like, he couldn't make up his mind. So, he liked it. <laughs> so, I wore that with, I don't know why I didn't take pictures, you guys. I guess I was just so excited for me and my husband's first Valentine's Day. We didn't take any pictures. But I wore that with some black fishnet stockings and my wedding shoes. Now, before you think, you like, your wedding shoes. My wedding shoes were different, and I wish I grabbed them. But they're in the closet. Um, they're gold. But stay tuned for my Valentine's Day video. It's just a little sneak peek of what me and my husband. Um, I kind of decorated the room that night. So it's just a little sneak peek of what we got into that night. Um, I do feature my shoes in that video with a different outfit. So you'll see like, oh, okay, cool. Because I didn't wear a typical wedding dress for my wedding night. It was a different dress. So anyways, alright, last thing I got from Ross was this cute little um what do you want to call it a sign or what now but it says ladies get your glam on isn't this adorable <laughs> i thought this was so cute 
and what it is I'm working on I'm working on my little recording area because I'm getting ready to get a camera and I have um, my husband picked up this um, computer desk with an extra it's like an extra um what do you call that shelving so I'm working with that and you know making my little project and glamming it up so this will definitely go on that so coming soon you guys you my background will be different um our, my recording system will be different because right now i'm recording on my webcam but um i thought this was super cute to go on that i love pink and black i love animal print it could be leopard or zebra print and i love i just love black white and pink together and a hint of gold mm, i love those colors together and that has all the colors and I thought this was like super cute so stay tuned for that uh, for this I paid it's not oh it is on here it was $4.99 where is it so I paid $4.99 for that and so that is all I got from Ross let me hurry up because I don't want this video to be too long <laughs> so I did Walmart Ross Next, um, I'm going to go to Alta. And after we went, me and my husband went to the seminar in Riceville Beach, North Carolina. We stayed there um, for Friday night. Saturday after the seminar, the last seminar, we left and we went to Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. And I, um, I got, I stopped to the Alta store there. <laughs> and that's my bag. Um, I just went looking to see if they had, because y'all when we left I I was certain I had everything I needed I left my foundation and I am so in love with BH cosmetics foundation you guys it stay tuned for a review of that I may do a January or February favorite videos I haven't done those videos before but comment below if you want me to start doing those videos I really appreciate it I appreciate you guys feedback so from Ulta, I just went browsing around. They had like the huge clearance section. So I got, it says yes to cucumber soothing hypoallergenic facial wipes. This doesn't have the price on it, but I do have my receipt. And I paid $2.99 for this. <clears throat> so I'm definitely, it's, it's um, they're facial wipes and they help remove your makeup. It's 10 wipes in here for $3.00. The next thing I got was this Sweet and Shimmer Jeweled Mirror. And it came packaged like this. And I, y'all, I travel all the time. And I don't have a mirror in my pocketbook. So this was like $1.97 on clearance. And so I picked that up. Let me see if I can open it really quick. So it's like that outside of the packaging. And when you open it up, let me see if I can get it. It's like that. So, very cute. Nice to go in my little purse. Another thing I got was, oh, I left it. Two things I do not have, and I apologize, you guys, which both were used for Valentine's night. One was a potion enchanted potion bottle bubble bath y'all know what time it is with that i got that for valentine's night um for my husband i did him a whole nice sweetheart bath theme and also the body benefits luxury padded sleep mask it was a sleep mask but i purchased i wanted him to have like a blindfold on i know i could have just used a tie or something like that but I want the actual blindfold. And when I went to Ulta, the um, the padded sleep mask was only $1.99. And it's super soft and super comfortable. And I, again, I apologize. I don't have it to show you guys in this video. But um, so we use that for Valentine's night as well. <laughs> and that is it from Ulta. All right, you guys. I'm already at nine minutes. So the last store that um, I'm going to show you what I got from is Yankee Candle, which was also in Myrtle Beach. And y'all know, many of you who do follow me on my social medias and things know that I make my own candles. Um, Mia's Precious Gifts, specializing in handmade natural bath and body care products. Um, 
I went to Yankee Candle because I saw on their door it said something about a dollar. Um, what was it? It said dollar candles and stuff like that. So I was like, oh, you know, I just with me transition transitioning back here to South Carolina, I haven't been able to get into my products and stuff like that. But stay tuned for that because I will be back up and running soon. But it was. They had these wax melts and the little mini candles for a dollar. Y'all, I love smell good. So, until I get my business and stuff back up and running this year, I was like, okay, why not? I might as well just go ahead. You know, one supporter of the next, so it's fine. Um, so, I got like five of these, yeah, five um, wax melts. And I'm going to place them in various places throughout the house. I just love walking into a house and it smells so good. Alright, so the first one I'm going to show you is called Summer Scoop. And it looks like this. And on the picture, it's like a picture of looks like raspberry ice cream. I see raspberries, blueberries. And what I get from this, I do get a fruity smell when I smell this. Yeah, oh my god, it smells so good. It's like a soft, fruity smell. That's what I get from this. Um, the next one I got was, um, pumpkin buttercream, and it smells like this. I love when you walk in somebody's house. My sister's house is a prime example. When you walk in there, it smells like a bakery. I'm like, oh my god, are you baking cookies? I want some cookies. She's like, no, that's my, um, candle warmer. And I'm like, oh my god, it smells so good. Oh my god, so it smells just like what it says, pumpkin buttercream. You know how you got the buttercream frosting, and the smell of pumpkin mixed together, like a little bit of not a whole lot of spice but just a little tad bit with the cake that's exactly what this the next one is pink sands oh my god it smells so good it's not really a beachy smell but it's a soft like a bath almost like a something you would have in your bathroom like a, when you're taking a bath something like that but it's so pure and soft and smells really good the next one I got is street sweet strawberry <laughs> exactly what it says sweet strawberry it smells like strawberries with a ton of sugar so as you can tell I really like sweet smelling things the last one is Midsummer's Night. And I remember getting this one because this one I think is the one that has the more masculine smell to it. Yes. This one has a masculine smell, so it'll be perfect in the bedroom for my husband because it's just it smells really good. It smells like a, a masculine cologne type. But with like a fresh like almost as if he just got the shower and sprayed some cologne on. That's exactly what this smells like. Alright you guys, so my video is at 13 minutes. Y'all know I try not to keep it too long for you guys. I want to keep it interesting and have you guys to watch it the whole way through without having to skip or fast forward or anything like that. So, if you like this haul video, please thumbs up this video. Let me know. Comment below and let me know what you think about these products. Have you tried these candle waxes before? It's different things like that. The mascara, let me know. I've seen these a lot on YouTube videos. So, I'm going to definitely give it a try. Let you, know, let you guys know how I like those products so I hear my kids yelling in there so now it's time for me to go get them out <laughs> so you guys thank you so much for watching this video and as always be inspired and be blessed bye guys